Hey gang, we are back again, episode four. Um, nothing to really launch with this time, nothing to talk about. Uh, I've got episode three in processing, should have that up soon. Um, thank you to everybody who's watched episode two. I know it was a long one. Uh, kudos and appreciation again if you made it through. If you caught some of the, the silliness in that one. <laughs> I'd love to hear what you thought about it. Like I said, I'm, I'm still figuring, still finding my way through all this. So, um, anyhow, I'm going to jump right in. I want to get as much content in for episode four as possible. This one's going to be action packed. I'm going to take on as many pirates as I can. My guys are to the point now to where they're strong enough to kind of keep going. I don't have to rest so much. So, here we go. Let's. Let's pick up right where we left off here in town. Ever the diligent pirate value is fishing while he's supposed to be on shore leave. We picked up about four levels last episode. Uh, I started putting some experience into my intelligence, uh, trying to speed up my advancement a little. Let's get rid of some of these extra weapons. We, yeah, I didn't want to sell the shovel, Dermer. That was a mistake. Um, not a big one, though. I will just buy a, another shovel at a cost of 44 lost gold. And I think I sold off all my valuables before. More or less. Red cape, you're immune to bleed status. I wonder if you just stick that on if you're already bleeding. We'll have to try that out. Alright, first of all, let's get dangerous. Upgrade our weapon, since we had some grindstones on us. I'm not really sure how to talk, you know, when, when I start speaking, uh, when I'm doing these Let's Plays, and I use, like, we and us and all that, it, it for some reason, sounds natural, but... I don't know, let me know, you guys think it sounds corny, should I just say me since I'm the one playing, or, or is this truly a community effort? Uh, in the future I do want to actually host a couple of games. Uh, I've got a couple of good ideas in, in mind for games in particular where it will be a community let's play, where viewers all put up polls and so on when there's important decision junctions for you guys to, to weigh in and, and tell me where to go next, what to do. I think those kind of games would be a lot of fun. Also, um, I'm always open to suggestions for games. Uh, I've got, like I said, some 490 Steam games that I haven't played. So chances are if there's something you want to see me play or you think uh, needs a little more coverage or could use my unique flair, <laughs> um, feel free to comment because chances are I have it. Um, if there's enough interest, I'll go get it. Um, you know, I, I want to be a crowd pleaser. So those of you who are watching every episode keeping up, uh, you drive the show. You tell me where to go. Don't take that literally, though. I'm not. I'm not going any place creepy with you. Don't ask. Especially you, Tahio. <laughs> and here we go. First battle of episode four get right to it. Maybe one of these times, yes, I'll catch them on their ship. I hate when they go to mine. I hate when you go to my ship. Okay, well you can go ahead and finish off that urn before doing fighting. Whatever. Good. Yes, leave. Ooh, I better pay him. He wants to get paid. And there you go. Much better. sure he stays focused. I, what I need to do, I need to get a secondary ranged weapon. So when I'm not dealing with pets, I actually have something to throw at these guys that's not a waste of time. I feel like I lose a ton of damage throwing this one damage cage at him that I don't even think does damage. I'll have to watch. Nope. Didn't do a thing. It 
the weak one. Success. More gold. More plunder. On to the next one. <laughs> My guy's dragging. Oh, too funny. <laughs> Just pitched a dead body off. These guys seem a little bit stronger in terms of hit points. There we go, lots of dodges. Keep it up, evil. Cotton evil. if they had a uh, means if you had a high intelligence or say high charisma captain then when you're fighting pirates like this there's the chance that you could convert them or buy them off I feel like that was an important part of pirate culture that's missing the, the bribe These level 2 fights have become a cakewalk. My one captain can take on two of them. If I go and I get another crewmate with reasonable stats, these will become trivial. Pick up things. Pick up all of the things. Thank you. the next one. I've been there? I don't remember that, but I guess I have. Well, let's stop in for a quick visit, and then we'll head off to fight more pirates. Clear out as many pirates as I can. I think I'm going to look for a good recruit at this island. I think I have enough money now to keep two, two pirates happy. Besides that, value is... He's coming along nicely. He's become a nice value. Yep, let's continue to improve his XP. I'm gonna kind of use him as a test bed for XP here and see if he catches up with my captain. Thinking about it, we should stock the ship. I really wish I could move the barrel. I should have thought of that while it was empty. I'm afraid I'm going to lose my fish. All right, Dustman, 
sword cutler, paladin, several expensive options here. Use boat salesman. I really don't know what these. Hmm. Well, I like the idea of paladin, except we're pirates. <laughs> he might not like some of what we're doing. Well, let's try it out. We'll pick him up. We'll take the dog breaker and the operative. It might be, you know. A little over my head buying that many pirates. Let's see. He is adventurous. This pirate is happiest when opening treasure or swashbuckling. He is fat. Ugh. He was a paladin. He fought for his lord, king, and country, only to unfortunately step into a time warp and end up in a pirate sim. <laughs> That's funny. Um, so, despite being fat, he doesn't have the minus associated with being fat. He has dexterity. He needs a ranged weapon. Alright, good. Let's look at the next guy. He is Daring. Bravery is this pirate's middle name. He is fat also. Well, he was a dog breaker. He trained the local governor's dogs. More misspellings. Come on, guys. He's fragile. He takes one extra damage. Ooh, not a good stat to have when you're a pirate. Well, I think you're going to eventually be a cannoneer if you live long enough. And Cali Bunting, he's daring. Bravery's the pirate's been lame. He's also fat. God, what's with all these fat pirates? He's an operative. He saved the entire galaxy from a savage race that wanted to consume them over the course of a trilogy of adventures, only to die, become a sentient demigod, get bored, and become a pirate. Oh, this guy's got an interesting story. Uh, he's pretty tanky. He's got good vitality. Do I have any good weapons to give these men? A Viking sword does six damage. Wow. Jeez. Guys, knockback is not spelled with... Oh my gosh. Can you see that? That's terrible. Alright. Who would benefit the most from that? This guy would, except he's fragile, and I'm afraid he's going to lose it by dying. This guy needs a ranged weapon. This guy's tanky. I'm going to give him the Viking sword. And in turn, also give him the looter's cap. I think I'm going to test out on the fragile guy, Thor's undies, and we'll see what they do. And for my fat paladin who needs a ranged weapon, we'll give him that just for the hell of it. Plenty of food. Here we go. Another barrel. Spare swords. Should save some money. need to set my crew up properly as well. You will be on the boarding party. And you will be on the boarding party. And you will be on the boarding party. Maybe value will get left alone now. Level two ships ought to be a real pushover now. Get these guys some experience. My only concern is being able to pay them. I'm not sure if rum is more efficient or if paying salaries is. Also, I'll need to buy all of these guys' skill books to make them most effective. So just like that already in this episode, we have taken out, what, two or three pirate ships and doubled the size of our crew. It's been a good day. My captain should take less damage in fights now, since there will be more targets, so... Ooh, I really need to teach these guys to swim, though. That's so essential. 
I probably should have done that already. Do they have any TP to spend? He does not. No, so they're going to have to gain a level in order to be able to take advantage of that. Let's continue to build our agility. It seems to be paying off. See who's made of the stuff. Gold chest. I hope that is good news. Go team, go. starting to look like I waited way too long to get my pirates together. That was way easy. I'm going to continue to use grindstones on my main character. And then I'm going to buy a grinding wheel for the ship so everybody else can level their weapons up without using my grindstones. At least level 6. Captain has to have the best stuff. Whoops, almost sailed away. I noticed in one of my previous videos I actually sailed away without plundering. I'm not doing that again. My, I don't know what we just stumbled upon. Lots of opportunities for pets. You guys go help out with him. No, go help. You just killed. Oh my god, no, you didn't. He didn't. I gave him swimming. Ugh. Such good news. I think I'm just gonna kill these animals off. It'd be nice to have them, but I'm not gonna, I'm gonna waste my time trying. Oh, I did get the parrot though. your ass over there. And my parrot's already dead. Jeebus. Seven damage. It's him. Damn strong ass tortoise. Captured a tortoise. <laughs> All right, everybody get back to safety. I 
will carry my tortoise friend. I will carry my tortoise friend. I will carry my tortoise friend. save my tortoise now that I just recovered. Because he won't climb on my head. Urgh. Whatever. shouldn't do another shouldn't do another sail uh, or another pirate fight without getting swimming for my crew that's I'm really risking it there's one kick into the water and it's a done deal so we don't get knocked overboard. Let's go buy some skills. Long sail. Back in town, although there's no tavern here, um, probably should head to a tavern next, get these guys' morale up. Uh, let's go ahead and get our skills here. We need three copies of swimming. Right? Three, yeah. Oh my goodness, there's lots of good skills here I didn't notice before. I thought they're new. Quadro strike? Hmm. Dash attack, 20 fast strikes. That sounds like excellent attack from a main fella. Okay, so I got 
three copies of swimming. We need three copies of fast learner. Mm, should probably wait for the rest. Don't want to overdo it. And also we'll check on our food status. Actually, it's saying it's out of stock now, so let's go ahead and pick this up and move it. I completely forgot I bought sp the spare swords for sparring. Let's put that down in the bottom. Uh, we'll put our food barrels up top here and fill it with food. So, let's put my crew... Well, let's see if they train automatically. They may. Well, the captain is. He probably is the one who needs to the least. Tavern food, skills, and ships. What was I doing? Tavern. Somebody gained a level. He will learn swimming and fast learner. in for sure leave. Keep them happy. Go ahead and stock the ship while I'm thinking about it. Oop, not that. With one more fish, I guess. several items that I should have already used. Give myself five more agility. More XP. Grind up the weapon a little. And that's it for now. starting to get happy now. You should get a little rum for the ship just in case. See if we can squeeze in one or two more ship battles before this video needs to end. So far, it's been very productive. Um, yep, you're level two. We'll go for you.
curious to see if these guys will begin training if I reassign them to the training group. Not you. You are... Crew. fast strikes for evil. can learn his abilities now. Successful boarding. Also, my last crewman gained his level to gain his two primary abilities that we need. And while we're looking at it, we'll use this grindstone on Captain Evil. Check out a new city. That is the wrap it up soon warning. So we'll check out this town and possibly do another pirate battle or two before wrapping up episode four. skills. Well, hopefully there's some unique skills here. Oh, there most certainly is. There's skills we have not gotten here. Combat focus, yes please. Map awareness, yes. First mate, mm. Let's take Dr. Aura. Gosh, I could spend all my money here. Combat evasion. More gold plundering ships. Captain's going to be quite skillful. 
Did I save? I did not save any TP. So next level, I'll get to apply some of these. Alright, well we'll get everybody back on the ship and uh, wrap up the video. I suppose this is as good a place as any to stop since I think next video is going to be just as action packed. Um, Evil's shaping up. He's got a lot of cool skills now. He's got a crew. Doesn't have any gold though, so that's got to be the goal soon is to start moving on to level 3 ships, which I think are the first ones that have cannons. Um, start making more money because I got to pay these guys or they're going to get kind of rowdy. So, anyways, thanks again for watching. Uh, I hope you'll tune in for episode 5. Um, it's been a pleasure making these for you. Again, thanks again for all your support, and we'll see you real soon. My favorite things start with a P. Yes, sir. My favorite things start with a P. Yes, sir.